Okay, this is Secret Assassin, and um, I'll be doing unboxing on the AMD Phenom 2 uh, times 4. Um, it's a quad core processor, 955 Black Edition, meaning it's unlocked. You can um, <clears throat> you cannot unlock six cores because this is not a six core processor, or you cannot even unlock it. But you can uh, overclock it um, over the normal AMD Phenom 2 processors. It has the AMD Fusion technology. Uh, <clears throat> It also says um, Vision combined press with ATA Radeon graphics card and um, experience AMD Vision. Got this for 140 bucks from Fresh.com. You can get it from um, Newegg or Amazon for 140 bucks. Sometimes they have it for 120 bucks at Tiger Direct. Um, it's 3.2 gigahertz uh, turbo uh, true quad core design, 8 meg cache. It has a socket AM3 and includes a heat tank like all other CPUs. It also has a free six-month trial by EVGA, AVG, and Towers. And also, there's the full version, and I'm going to give it to my idiot cameraman here, who's just going to hold the camera and not get anything else in the shot. Fun. Okay, so I'll be doing an unboxing of this. As you can see, this is the processor. Bad thing is, there's no plastic here, so you can, I, as you can see, I can easily poke the processor. And open it. I like the box. It's black. You know, it has the cool AMD logo on it. It's small. It's kind of heavy. <laughs> What's so funny, cameraman? Unless you want me to see your real name in it. The yeah, university yeah, won't yeah, accept yeah. you. As you can see, I just unlocked it. It says 15 days return policy, so I don't think I can return this anymore. I will be um, putting this with a MSI 878 Fusion motherboard. Um, hoping to overclock it to around 7 gigahertz with a Corsair 870. Hydro cooler. <clears throat> As you can see, first thing we see is this cardboard box. Um, the side, we have our processor with the AMD sticker. I really like this design. It um, actually protect it. There's foam on the bottom. Um, so with that. And then here is the manual. Um, I hate processors manual because they're like this. It's going to open up to like a mini poster. Oh, I can't get to everything. Doesn't, yeah, you don't have to. Yeah, yeah. Nobody's reading the manual. So it, it gives you the basic <clears throat> procedure on how to install the fan and stuff. Um, um, one more thing is I've had really, I've heard really bad reviews on the um, cooler for the, I mean, the heating that comes with the, the stock heating, the uh, Phenom 2. So I would re probably recommend uh, something like aftermarket cooler, like the Corsair 870. This is the auto in install and AVG end towers. As you can see, it's a mini CD. Um, then this is the heatsink itself. Um, What's the red mark for, sir? Harry. I'm in cameraman. I will send your grades to the every single college app okay, you applied okay, for, okay. and you will not get in. Okay? Now shut the hell up and just. But what's the red mark for? I don't know. Ask your mother. Okay. Okay, so it was kind of a little messed up, but here it is. Here's the stock heat sink. Um, includes the clips and stuff, and um, it doesn't look that good. It looks kind of really boxy. The Intel heat sinks are kind of more roundish. Um. Also includes this, and especially I hate this because some of the cables can just go in here. I know, so you really tie this up. Um, but except for that, um, here is the heating. It comes with its own little um, thermal paste, and it has two, actually four heat pipes. See four and two on each side, and then it has a fan on top. Um, I heard it's really loud. Um, the cooling performance. I think you can overclock couple um you, can, you probably can uh, overclock to like 3.6 or something with this heat sink but i would really recommend an aftermarket heat sink um something like like a uh, zelman or a thermal take one so yeah uh keep that in mind thanks for watching the video